Yeah. What's good? I'm a boy, man. Hey, little bro. Don't come outside, man. It's not safe for you. It's not safe for you. It's not safe for me. Your family members, even the ones that be hanging out on the street, it's not safe for nobody. Even the ones that go up and go to work, it's not safe for nobody, bro. It's not safe. The streets is not safe for nobody outside, bro. It's not safe, bro. It's not safe at all, bro. And don't put yourself in situations trying to make it look like you safe out there because you hang around a bunch of people. Because you know these people with it. Because you got a couple of guns on you. Because you in your car. Because you only going to the store. You know that people at the corner store. You know who hang out. You know who on the block. You ain't got nothing to worry about because they ain't got nothing to do with you. I'm here to tell you, yes, you do. You have to watch your back 24 7, 7 days a week. Even God telling you to watch your back. You have to pay attention. I want to say thank God for waking me up. I'm being real, bro. I always do that, bro. You know? Bro, you, bro, you, bro. You, you, you not safe, bro. You not as safe as all. If your kids, if you got kids, your nieces and nephews, your little cousins, your mama, your aunties, your grandma, your uncles, your uh, granddaddy, uh, stepdad, you know, step uncles, your cousins, distant cousins, out of state cousins, motherfucking spirit, whatever state or city they in, nobody safe outside. I don't care, not in America. Not in America. Even your people can be overseas. They not safe outside at all, bro. It's always something going down outside, bro. It's not cool to be hanging outside, especially, especially, especially. First of all, it's not cool to be hanging outside on a regular day. It's definitely ain't cool to be hanging with people who got ties in the streets, bro. Who connected to the streets, bro. Who be on the streets 24-7, 7 days a week doing them. It's not cool. Definitely not cool. It's not cool. It's not safe for them. It's definitely not safe for you. Most of you don't have a vehicle. You don't have a vehicle on your own. Some of y'all on bus or feet, bro. On top of that, your car is not running that good. You don't have nothing brand new. Even though you got something brand new, it's out there on the street. You don't even have a garage on your own. Matter of fact, your garage don't even close all the way, bro. You think just because you moved out the city or you in downtown or you just right there in Inglewood ain't nothing going to change or happen to you. Yes, it is. It's still going to happen. Your life still going to change, bro. It's not even safe being regular, so how could you think it'd be safe? Because you know the people that's on the block, on that corner, or you know that game over there. Or you think you know, because you hang over here or live over here, you know the people that they into it with. Bro, don't kid yourself. Don't play yourself, bro. Don't make yourself look stupid out there. Be responsible when it comes to your life. Matter of fact, I'm going to start making videos. Be responsible when it comes to your life, bro. Don't come outside. Ooh, the, ooh, that video sound good. I don't know where that came from, but it's coming, bro. I want to thank the most high for giving me that thought, bro. But real talk, bro. Don't come outside. If you ain't got to be out there, bro. Ain't nowhere to go, bro. You damn ain't got to travel. Whatever, whatever in, in America, in the United States, alone, bro. You can't go nowhere local. Everywhere you go, it got to be distance, 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 distance. Don't come outside. If you don't have traveling expenses or your car don't work that good or you don't have gas money, don't come outside, bro. Stay inside. Protect yourself, bro. Protect yourself, bro. Don't be stupid out here, bro. These streets don't love you. These streets don't love nobody, bro. The streets don't love nobody. The streets on everybody ass, bro. Anybody can get it. And you keep thinking, well, just because I got God, we may not gonna happen. Oh, I got this glicky, this sticky, this Mickey, this pink pink, whatever the fuck you call it, you wanna call it, bro. I got my little brother inside my pants, or my little sister, or my baby, bro. I got my pet smart, whatever the fuck you wanna call it, your pistol, bro. Shit still can happen, bro. Your jeans can be just a little bit too tight. And it'd be hard for you to get it out. Or your motherfuckers just want to jam just because cause you don't know how to clean. Anything can happen, bro. Don't come outside, bro. Learn how to chill. I'm about to drop a video called Learn How to Chill in the Crib. There's nothing wrong with the crib, bro. I'm just saying, you have to be smart, bro. 
Don't come outside. Outside is not good for everybody, bro. Listen to me. Don't come outside, bro. Don't stay. Stay in the house, bro. Ain't no wrong staying in the house, bro. Stay in the house, bro. Get your ass a fan, a ceiling fan, an air condition. Get your ass some Netflix, HBO. Bro, get get your ass a Xbox. Get your ass a PlayStation. Get your ass a cardboard. I mean, uh, a, a game board game or whatever the fuck. A board game. What get you something to entertain your time. Matter of fact, yo, some of y'all need some rest, bro, because y'all don't be sleeping anyway. Half of y'all sleep with y'all TVs and lights on, so you definitely ain't getting no sleep. Every little noise you hear, you wake up and, and make sure you boop, turn that TV back on or they hit that light switch. You got a lot going on in your mind mentally, bro. Some of y'all sleep with y'all bedroom door open, wide open. Because you afraid of sleeping alone. Or some of you afraid of sleeping alone and you got somebody in the bed with you and you still feel alone. Even some of y'all still afraid to sleep alone. You got people in the crib and you still afraid to sleep alone. You better stop it, bro. Get your life together, bro. Focus on you, bro. You ain't got time to be outside constantly, 24-7, 7 days a week. Outside don't like you. Outside, I'm like a drop a video soon called Outside Don't Like You. It don't like you, bro. It don't like me. It definitely don't like you, bro. And I don't do half the shit you be doing. I know you big, you be big, big, big talking shit on them outside of people, bro. Everybody you meet, you saying you giving them that look. Or you looking at them crazy. Or you talking big shit about them, bro. So you already got motherfuckers on your ass anyway. So I don't know why you keep going, trying to go outside. Take your ass in the crib. Every day you don't need to come outside. Everybody don't need to see your face. You don't need to be entertaining. Your door don't need to be wide open for the public. You don't need to keep your screen door open where the windows open too, bro. No, no. Slow down. You doing too much. Stay inside. Don't come outside. Ain't nothing wrong with being in the crib. I'm being real, bro. You doing too much. You doing too much. You doing too much. Yeah, you know you are. Come on, bro. You getting warned. You getting all types of warnings inside. Matter of fact, your phone warn you that you doing too much. Your Facebook, your Instagram, your Snapchat, your YouTube, your Twitter, any social platform you own warn you and tell you that you doing too much. So you need to stop, bro. I'm up awake. Like, subscribe, turn notifications, share that video. Don't come outside.